Hello. Hello, สวัสดีค่ะ Hello. How are you today? I'm fine. Okay, great. What Pretend. Does... Okay, questions <laughs> <laughs> for us today. What does adorable? A door. Adorable. Remember, you had a door. A door. You you look. You asked us. You asked us about a door, oh. and now I mentioned adorable, and now you you also want to know adorable. Adorable. Connected to a door, but a little bit different. Adorable is. Uh, I thought it was pretty. Something cute. Something cute, like a, like that's small, a small version of a big one. So a puppy or a kitten. So there's a big one. There's a cat or a dog, and then the small one is cute or adorable. More But than cute. We can say to to people. Yes. Like you are adorable. Yeah, but it won't. But if some guy is tough, then they won't like that. So if you if, if you go to girl, girl. yeah that's okay. well it's okay but it, it needs to be small so if someone's really fat and you say you're adorable <laughs> that might not really make sense also if you went to like someone who's a really great fighter and you're like wow you're adorable they might hit you because they're <laughs> they don't small cute yeah like a kitten a kitten or a puppy usually are adorable when And when old people act like kids, we might say someone's adorable. So if you, if your grandmother does something like a kid, act does some action like a baby, mm-hmm. someone might say they're adorable. But they need to be cute also. They need to be good looking. So like a like a small rat. Might not be adorable. Some people might think so, but small rat. It just like a like a small devil. Is not is not really adorable. If it's ugly and small, that doesn't. That's not adorable. There's some research outside. It it depends. Uh, but a, a is, snake. Not people adorable. don't usually like snakes, because their reptiles are a little bit scary to most people. So adorable for a snake, um, not usually. Usually something that's furry, like a chicken, like a chick, or a kitten, or a puppy, those are adorable. Uh, if it's very big, like an elephant, even a baby elephant, um, you won't say it. Adorable. You, you can, but it's a little bit strange because it's it's big. Mm. So. Um, It's okay, but usually adorable is is gonna be small. Mm, can say adorable with kids and yes. girls. You can say it about anyone, but it should be something that's Not small and cute. Guy. You guys. can, but they might be get angry. <laughs> <laughs> it you can be. If I say to Vinicio, he will hit me. Ah, <laughs> uh, he might not be happy uh, <laughs> to hear that. Yeah, if if a fan said you're adorable. He might not like that. Technology can also be adorable. Like if you had a phone that was really small and cute, someone could say that's adorable. Um, Or what? Food, not really. Um, but sometimes. Cake. No, not no. food. No. Um, you could say it if it was if you had like a very small cake, you might say it's adorable, but not not really. It it should be something a little bit not related to food, something that's uh, has a bigger version of itself, like like I said, like a dog is big and a puppy is small, but it looks the same. Mm-hmm. So it should be related to something bigger. That's that's what I'm imagining. Okay, okay why don't you try? What do you, what does Sipti think is adorable? <laughs> <clears throat> a song is not adorable. Um, a sentence is not adorable. The people who say it could be adorable, but it's not going to be something that you. It's not going to be something that you say. My mom thinks 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 dogs are adorable when they. They will. They are. They are 
young. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Puppies. But okay, but try something a little harder. Try something about like a person. Person. Yeah. Because right. that's that's fine, but it's very easy. You might be confused when someone uses adorable about another thing. Try another example. When my when older people stay with kids or their kids, they are look. They. They look. Look. Adorable. Who looks adorable? The old people. The old people. Or can. You can, but that's an opinion. Not all old people are adorable. Mm. So the sentence is okay, but we <laughs> we don't know. Some old people are are angry. Get off my lawn. Get out. Of, get out of here. They might not be adorable. When my grandma get and get, get be get getting get 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 uh, gets gets angry. She looks adorable. That's okay. Mm -hmm. um, it, it would make someone even angrier if you told them that, though. If you said to your husband, "You're adorable when you're angry," that's going to make them more angry because it's going to say that 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 their anger looks like a child, like they're not tough, or that or that you don't believe them when they're angry. But yeah, you could say that, but it will make people angry. Then I go. That. That. Not. That. 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 That's not good. Depends. Uh, if you want to make them angry, then it's good. If I said you are adorable. Um. <laughs> yes. Uh. You, you could would, say that. You, you could say that about angry. a person. Um. Would I like it? I wouldn't mind, but I I wouldn't be happy. If someone said to me, "You're adorable," um, I, it wouldn't make me happy. I wouldn't feel happy, but I wouldn't get angry. But if I was angry and you said, "You're adorable when you're angry," that would make me angry because it means that my anger doesn't no, scare serious. anyone and it's not. It doesn't mean anything. Okay. But if you're talking about the someone looking good. Um, it might be a little bit bad because of the size. Adorable means small, so everything like the pumpui. Uh, that they're not big enough. So if you said, if someone said to me, "You're adorable," I would feel like they think I'm too small. Mm. A little bit, but it, it wouldn't. It wouldn't bother me. But I. I don't think I would really be happy about the compliment. Um, uh, that's adorable. We say uh, he's adorable. That's adorable. Uh, if tree or flower, flower, flowers. Um, I don't think Cact a flower is adorable. What is it called? Cactus. Cactus. Still alive. Cactus. <laughs> Cactuses. Cacti. Um, no. Uh, you you can say it, but no, a plant is not adorable because usually it it's the same size forever. I mean, a tree does grow, but no, I don't think a tree is adorable. No, it, it needs to be something that can that can move and uh, has a little bit more more life to it. Although, like I said, it can be technology. A phone can be adorable. So, maybe a tree could be adorable, but I've never heard anybody in America say the tree is adorable before. Okay. Anyway, uh, that was good. Um, if you want to, if you think Sibdi is adorable, send <laughs> her a message <laughs> on Instagram. Okay. Anyway, let's get back to Sibdi's favorite new game. IELTS. No, we're done with the IELTS. Oh, uh, wow. We're, we're on. <laughs> Well, until the <laughs> test, until the test, uh, we're back to controversial, controversial questions 
for safety. First question. Should foreigners be allowed to vote? So do you think that I should be allowed to vote in Thailand? It's not my country. Uh, I'm not Thai. But do you think that I should have the right to vote in your country? What do you think? Mm. Should foreigners be allowed to vote? Foreigners mean people from another country? Yeah. What do you think? Mm. Mm. <laughs> for people. Well, not for anything that's adorable. For law. I, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hopefully for people, not for... We don't want dogs to vote in Thailand. Mm, I think... I think... Should not lock. Shouldn't? Shouldn't. Okay, because? If they didn't stay or if they did, didn't live in that country for a long time. How long should it be before they get to vote? Like they have family in their country. It would be 10 or 20. Or 20 years. To 10. I 10 think years. 10, 10 Th years. I think that's actually the uh, like close to the law of, right. of immigration is about yeah. 10 years if in some they countries. Stay mm -hmm. For a long time, they should have, should have, chance, the right, chance to, chance, chance, chance to vote. Not vote. Vote. No. Wo vote. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Vote. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Okay, good. That was the easy one to get simply warmed up for the other. Not one. easy. I think. Next one. Um. Should software piracy, piracy be legal? Piracy. Piracy. Pirate. P pirate. Pirate. A pirate yes. is like Jack Sparrow. We call those people pirates. They steal mm -hmm. from just uh, a lot. Like, Jack Sparrow. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. They and usually the have ocean. like an eye patch and a parrot here. Hello. Yeah. And they had like a, a musket or something. They usually were on the sea. Still, uh, there are still some pirates, but a long time ago it was very common. And they had boats and they would steal from other ships and they were called pirates. Pirate is when you steal something from other people, mm. but not usually um, from someone's house. That's not a pirate. Piracy is is stealing something that is not a, an object in someone's house. If you come and you steal the sword, uh, that's not piracy. Uh, piracy now we use for, for music. Belong. Things on the internet. Something people belong. No, no, things on the internet. Uh. That, that people don't, they have licenses for, but they don't, it's, it's not like money. It's something that we don't know if you stole it or not, maybe. Like if you, if you have a song and I have a song and I paid for mine and you didn't pay for yours, mm -hmm. we would say you are a music pirate. Mm -hmm. But pirate, piracy in the old days was on ships. You, you can't be a pirate on the land. It, it was only on boats. But nowadays we use this word to describe people who steal programs like, uh, you know, Adobe or something is common. People like to steal Adobe products. Adobe. Stealing software from the internet. I did not steal any software to make this show. I paid for it, uh, like I said before, Probably on I the show. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Sifty stole software, but we don't know. Anyway, uh, Sifty, what do you think? Should software piracy be legal? 
Yes, if I come into your house and I steal a sword, okay, that's a crime. But if you make a song and I steal it, is that okay? I listen to it for free. What do you think? Listen hard. You can probably I did before. <laughs> no, Simpty never. Ha Simpty has never stolen any software before. I don't she, know how to do. She accidentally said that. I she don't did. know how to do. <laughs> okay, exactly. Mm. But sometimes people don't have it, money, right? Right. That's that's why we're here to hear your opinion. What do you think? Mm -hmm. <laughs> But usually when, when people steal from for free, they have like fixed time for to use use that program or Adobe, right? No, that that's a trial. That's not stealing. Stealing is when you is when a programmer hacks or cracks oh. the software and you get the full version and you didn't pay for it. Oh yeah. Uh, oh. Or stealing music from the internet, we call that uh, music piracy. Mm, should should that be legal or not? Is that okay? It's not okay. That's not okay. Yeah, I think we shouldn't do. Okay, so if we get, we're gonna get Sipti's computer. We're gonna open it up, and we're gonna. I think other people <laughs> did. If there's not anything me. on there that you didn't pay for, what should happen? If we find someone, let's, it's not Sipti, because Sipti pays for all the things that she, that she uses. But let's say we find your mom or mm -hmm. some other criminal, mm -hmm. and we find out that she has a Justin Bieber song mm -hmm. on her iPhone that she didn't pay for. What should we do? We should... Kill her. No. No. Like, chat. Charge. Okay. How much? Um... We should let the law design. <laughs> You're the law today. What should the law be, Sipti? You should read how much per how much per a song. We should. Repeat. So you're only going to charge them two dollars. You catch them, and they just pay two dollars. If not. So then, shouldn't wouldn't the strategy? We should set some price for charge. After we know, like one hundred. Dollar or but not over. Okay, what do you think would be a good price? I don't know. <laughs> what price would get you to pay for the software? Double or triple. double, triple. So if you get caught, you got to pay triple. I think that's a good idea. I think probably it needs to be a little bit more than well, triple, but that's a good idea. Because I think one people one one person will be download. Many songs. Will be download? No, no. Will download many songs. Yeah. And they have to pay $100 for each song that they download. Double for each song. Double. So just $4. So I download the song. If, if I get caught, no, I, I got to pay, pay $4. Song. If you have 10 songs, 10 songs, you have to pay for what? $40. Dollar, dollars. Okay. What if I have a song of people uh, taking a shower? Is that okay? Do I have to pay for that? <laughs> I think no, that's free. Pay. <laughs> that's free. Okay, that's, that's free. Okay, next one. Cloning. Should, should people, should cloning be legal? You know what cloning is? Mm -hmm. What do you think? Copy people. Yeah. Should we be able to clone people? What do you think? People, no. Hmm. I think, I think, if, uh, if we need, if we have to clone, cloning. Clone? Clone people. Do you want to be cloned? We sh no. Oh, no. <laughs> what would Sipti's clone be like? <laughs> if I, if myself, <laughs> another okay. one. Okay. No, you'd be, wouldn't you be best friends? It would uh, be just like you, right? You'd be able to party forever. Wouldn't you like a twin? But uh, many things about me make other people get headaches. <laughs> That's for sure. Okay, but don't you think that having a twin would be nice? What if you yeah, had a twin? I, that is my boss, my dream. 
when I was young, I want to have. I, I wanted to have a twin. Because. Because. I I feel like I will have. I will always have a friend stay with me. So you're afraid that your friends will leave I if they're not if they don't alone, look like you. To stay alone, but I didn't. I don't want other people to stay with me. But if it's me, probably we will we'll be okay. You know? So you're saying that if someone looks like you, that means they can never leave you. You can't do anything wrong to someone who looks like you. I mean, we will see when we grow grow up together, growing up, and stay and stay together. I don't know what you mean by see. We what if you're blind? What if both of you are blind? We will see each other and stay together all the time. Yeah, but what does that mean? What's the meaning of that? When when I was young, it's good for children to have um, sister or friends. So you're saying when you were a kid, you didn't have any friends? I have, but I I, I have I. I had, but, but, I mean, I want, I want some si I sister. I wanted some sister or brother close it to me. But do you want a twin, or you just wanted a brother? Because you. But if twin is the same, right? The same person, same age. Not exactly the same person. Looks similar. But uh, but if you're bad to someone who looks like you, they still aren't going to be your friend. So if you if you're my twin and I hit you, you're still going to be angry at me. What's the difference of having a friend or a twin? But usually I saw twin love each other, and they have okay. some sins. When someone do you think that's real or are they just lying? I think it's real. Okay. Because probably do you have any friends that are twins? Yeah. I remember you talked about twins one time, on yeah. a on a story. When I was young. Guys. Too. Right, and what did they do? What was the story? I can't remember. Oh, he's the. Um, they were fat, right? Not fat, handsome. Oh, okay. There was and oh, you tricked one of them. One, of, they used to trick you because you couldn't see they the difference. They tricked me because I, I can't, yeah, 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 who is boom, who is bomb. Right, I couldn't. I could operate. I, I can't, I don't remember. Oh, yeah. no, I couldn't. I couldn't. Let's try another word. I couldn't. I couldn't. No. <laughs> I couldn't see who is. The real sentence is I couldn't tell them apart. I couldn't tell them apart. But you can just say I, I couldn't. I couldn't see. I couldn't see the difference. The difference. Or I didn't know. I didn't uh, know who was who. I couldn't see. I didn't know the difference. The difference. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now okay. those were the easy Back words. To uh, those were the easy ones, right? Cloning. Cloning. Yes or no? I think. I think. I think no. No, because. Because you will make. Make. Everything confused. And problem. Everything confused? What does that mean? Like someone. It's like our show. Someone will trick other people to be another one, or bad thing will come. Comes. Come. Bad. Bad things will come. So you're worried that people would trick other people? Yeah, criminal. Okay. Or like in the many movies. Mm hmm Okay, fine. Okay, let's get Sipti in trouble with um, some of the hard ones now. Sipti, is obesity a disease? <laughs> is what? Obesity a disease. Obesity? Yeah, that means people who are really, really fat. Obesity? It's yes. called obese. obese. So you're fat and then obese. That means really, really, really fat. You look like a hippo. So, the duck. <laughs> is obesity a disease? Some people say. Disease means bad. Oh. No, disease means Get. something that you catch. You can't change it. It's like a, it's something that you, like a coronavirus. You can't choose. Some people say 
that obesity is not because you like to eat a lot of brownies. Mm -hmm. It's a it's something that that happened to you because of uh, the environment or because other people are bad oh. to you or something something's wrong and you caught it like a disease. But not about from what you eat or what you did. Well, that's part of it, but people are saying that maybe you eat too much because you're sad because Mm. Uh, the environment is mean to you, or your parents should have been kinder to you. Whatever it is, some people say that obesity is a disease. What do you think? Are people who are obese are they just eating too many brownie milkshakes, or are they like that because the environment is hurting them, like a coronavirus? They caught it. And they can't change it. What do you think? Is obesity a disease? Mm, a little bit confused. Like mean people. Like who mean? No. Means it. Keep, it's it. mean. It means people who are fat. Obese. Obese, because. They have problem problems from other things around them or people or what they say, and that I'm that trying not them I'm trying fat. not to define it too carefully because I that's why we're here is for you to tell us. If I told you those things, then it would be too obvious about that it was my opinion and not yours. But yes, the basic idea is, when someone is obese, is that because they eat too much, or is there another problem? Make them eat too much. Too much. Maybe not even eat too much. Maybe something else. Maybe they, they when they were a kid, they they their body didn't develop right, or something else is wrong. It's genetic, or something like that. Is it because they're lazy and eat too much, or is it because the environment has done something, like a disease? That's why we say disease. What do you think? Mm. <laughs> These are the easy ones. Remember, this is my list of easy questions. Uh, easy. <laughs> <laughs> many, many American people would not want to answer this question because they could get in trouble. But of these people, I talk, I had talk, talking. I talked with. Talk with. The most of them said. They. they Can you buy me lunch? No. Got fat because. They eat too much. They they were they ate too much, and they don't they didn't like to exercise. Exer exercise. 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 Exercising. Exercise. Exercise. Not exercise. 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 Mm -hmm. And they eat, they eat bad food. Okay. I think. But that's not the question. <laughs> so the question is simply: Is obesity a disease? What do you think? So, what we're looking for is yes or no. And then we're looking for an explanation. I think no. It's not a disease. I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> come on, <sir. laughs> uh, come on. Yes or no? First, first, when someone asks you a difficult question like this, and you want to answer, you should give them a clear answer first. Especially in America, people will respect you by giving a clear answer. If you can't. Then you know you have to sometimes play a game. We say political speaking like a politician. But today we're going to learn 
how to throw Sipti under the bus. I mean, uh, <laughs> teach Sipti how to answer difficult questions in an environment where you will be respected. So if you don't care, then that's okay. You don't need to answer. But I'm trying to teach you how to answer difficult questions to people who you really want to help. So if you're a doctor or if you are a lawyer, or if you are a president or if you are working for some type of society and someone asks you, is obesity a disease? If you say, well, you know, sometimes I go home and I have lunch, they're not going to respect that answer, mm -hmm. right? So we want to say yes or no first, if we can. If it's a bad question, sometimes people try to trick you, you have to protect yourself. But I'm not trying to do that. In this case, yes or no, and then an explanation why. So, Simti, is obesity a disease? What do you think? Disease can go on or not. Yes. It can. And sometimes. Some <laughs> diseases can't. Okay. I think yes. It's a disease. Yes. You said no a few times, but now you're good. I think yes. <laughs> okay. Because think yes. Because people who are obese, they they would have problems before they get. They fat. would have no no they they probably probably they had. Problems. Pr pro pro problems. Pro problems. 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 Pro problems. With R and L. <laughs> problems. Okay. Before they got fat. Okay. Be so you're saying people who are fat, they had a problem first. Yeah. It's not because so they're hungry. It's not because there was a a delicious restaurant Can near their house. Some people, some people, some people was very. Some people. Some people were very angry. Oh no, hungry. Not hungry. Okay. Very much. They yes. they didn't probably they didn't have anything to eat before, and then they they their life changed. They changed. They have something to eat, and that make them eat a lot. Not eat. Eat a lot and get fat. Finally, get fat. Mm -hmm. And some people eat a lot because they got depressed. Like most girls. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Good. Yeah, that's a good answer. Uh, it's definitely the easier side. Uh, arguing the other side is is a little bit more difficult, and you can get in trouble. Um, choosing that choosing that side is is uh, a little bit easier for sure. More more polite, kinder, um, and you gave good examples. I think it makes sense. Yeah, it's good. Mm -hmm. I like that. Next one. Torture. Torture is sometimes acceptable. What torture? Torture means, like if, if you are a terrorist. Or terrorist. People who who bomb things. They go to Bangkok with a bomb and they go to a, go to a, a government building and they blow it up. Mm. And kill themselves. Um, or could. just leave. That's a suicide bomber. Uh, but it could be another, if you just leave it there or you do something, then it could just be another type. So let's say you are a terrorist and I'm a terrorist and I go and I, I'm going to cause trouble. I'm going to steal Sipti's grandfather's sword. And you know about it, but you're not going to tell anyone. The police catch you and they know that you're friends with me and that I I'm going to cause trouble. So then they say, Sipti, tell us where John is. And you say, no. They say, tell us. And you say, no. So then they start to beat you mm -hmm. or do something wrong to you. That's mm -hmm. called torture. 
Mm, try to get. Is that okay? As answer. Yeah. And Can the police or the military torture someone to get the information that they want? What do you think? This is a big question in the United States because we had trouble with waterboarding. So, the United States government, uh, in some uh, prisons and in some areas, used to wa waterboard people. So they put you on a board like this, usually, but your head is down here and your feet are up here, and then they cover your face with a with a t-shirt or a cloth, and then they pour water mm. over your face. May you can beat. It makes you feel like you're drowning, and you and you can't breathe, and you I feel like you're drowning. That's called waterboarding, to torture you, to tell your secrets. What do you think, Cindy? Is it okay to torture people <laughs> to get the information that um, you want? I have to answer. <laughs> In my head. <laughs> yes, that's a good idea. Think about the idea. Think about your idea before you talk. That's that's a good idea. Mm -hmm. What do you think, Sante? Torturing people? Right or wrong? I think it's, it's wrong because it's too too much. Terrible. Too much terrible? Too much. Add that to Sipti's English dictionary. No, I don't know. Bad. Okay. It's worse. It hurt other people. Too much. Okay. It hurt. It's too. It too. It's. It's too hurt. Hurt. No. It's too much. Bad to other people. I don't know. No. Try again. It too. It too bad. It. It's too bad yeah. to other people yeah. who mm -hmm. didn't done and didn't do anything wrong. Wrong. Okay. We what if they did something wrong? Then it's okay. <laughs> we should need. We should try to get some information from another. We should try another way. What if there's no time? Like what if you only have, have an hour? Met machine to check your. <laughs> <laughs> but someone That's called a lie it, detector. Right? That's called a lie detector. Right, lie, lie detector. But that only works when they're talking. So if someone doesn't talk, then lie detectors <laughs> aren't going to work. Or some medicine. Make people yes, but that's a type of torture also. Yeah, sometimes they use but LSD or something to drug you. Better mm -hmm. than, than torture. But that is a type of torture that would still be considered torture. But it's not hurt, right? It. It's the one. It. It's. It. It not. It. Is. It. It. Wasn't. It not. I don't know. Doesn't. It doesn't. She, he, she, it doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't hurt. Uh, it, it could. It, sometimes it does. It causes brain damage. There are some chemicals that you could use to, to truth serum or something to get somebody to talk. It, it could damage their brain. Yeah. So, no. You're saying no. Uh, okay, I think. <laughs> <laughs> yes or no? Come on. So Sibdi, you you're the head of the police. But if right right for the criminal, but probably be bad for other people. Right. That's why this is called <laughs> controversial. Controversial discussion topics. Exactly. I think I think yes. But Oh you've changed now. <laughs> and now torture is good. Yeah. Watch out. We, Watch out if Cindy yes, becomes the, should, the boss. We should be kind to... Don't work for Cindy's company. <laughs> <laughs> to that criminal. You'll be kind to the criminals. I mean... So Hannibal Lecter. I mean... You catch Hannibal Lecter and you say be kind to him. Because he's 
he he has the blood and the skin of someone he ate on his mouth, and you say, "Be kind to him." No, I mean, be nice to him. Use the good way for human. Not the good way for human. Good way to get to get some information. What's a good way? Like, if you had many type of torture, you should use. The, the kind one. Yeah. <laughs> so like, just like, please like, tell me. Level. You, just yeah. like, touch them. Like, can you tell me, please? Like. No. <laughs> don't you think that if someone. I know it's hard. If to... it was kind torture, then they wouldn't tell it, you. Yeah, I know. They won't. Isn't the por- isn't the purpose of torture? Some people. That it's going to be bad. To be like, be quiet. Exactly. So yes or no. Yes. Okay. But, so you now you're saying torture but, is good. But we should, <laughs> we should, should know how much to hurt other people. <laughs> let, okay. Don't let them, they die. Don't let. Them don't die. let them die. Mm-hmm. Just keep them alive and keep them being tortured. That is very bad. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I think too. <laughs> okay. Anyway, uh, watch out if if you vote for Sipti to be sometimes president. Sometimes we need to hurt one people to one one person to help a lot of people. Mm-hmm. And you're saying that's okay. We don't have choice. <laughs> we don't have an a a choice. Do you think you could torture someone? What if they asked you to do it? They say Sipti. I can't. They say, Zipti, listen, I you're won't. the only person in that area. We need you to get the information. If not, or millions of people are going to die. You need to torture. I need to do. Do you, do you think you could do it? If for one million people, I will. Okay. <laughs> you want to see Zipti torturing. <laughs> bad karma. I remember there was a video game. I can't remember which one it was. It, it might be Grand Theft Auto, but I can't remember. In the game, you have to torture a guy by cutting off his finger and a lot of people played the game they they said this is really horrible i shouldn't be forced to do this i should i should make i should be able to make a choice it's very difficult uh to do that it's very hard to decide if torture is acceptable and it would be a lot worse if you had to do it right that's very hard okay so zibdi's not exactly sure but uh she does think that torture uh is okay. So watch out if you work for Sipti. <laughs> if Sipti becomes president uh, Sometimes someday. Sometimes we have to, right? Watch out. Uh, Sipti could torture you. Next one. Do you think that soft drugs should be legalized? So hard drugs are the really bad ones, like heroin, oh. And cocaine. I don't know what cocaine is considered, heroin. but heroin and probably crystal meth. I think Thai people ice, ice, right? That's that's Keto probably meth. a hard drug, and then the soft drugs are like marijuana. We, we, yeah, I don't know what other what uh, what the other soft drugs are, but there's soft drugs. That means the ones that are like mushrooms probably mm-hmm. are soft drugs, and then but, the hard drugs are like the. So what do you think, Sipti? Should soft drugs be legalized? Not hard drugs, because that's not that's actually a question that if soft, is not very hard for most people to answer. Soft drugs include include mushroom. Mushrooms. You know, I'm not an expert on on any on terrible. those things. I saw someone very bad uh, <laughs> jump uh, off the cube. I I told you before, right? No. Right. Hmm. Very terrible. There was a guy. Guys. Let's hear it. Come on. They. Did you torture him? Hmm? Did you torture him? No, okay, no. no. Okay. They okay. just used some mushroom. Okay. He used some mushroom mushrooms and after that probably he get he got drunk no drunk is only get alcohol. high and he he thought 
he what he sees another land what he what he see saw is was another land i don't think it's like land like different he did he can't he he couldn't know in front of him was he okay no 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 he, he couldn't no not no he couldn't see in front no he couldn't see and what yeah what yeah jump on no, no, the no no that's the right word he couldn't see the curve cliff cliff and he kept walking running yeah and he fell like fall. the road runner like in the cartoons it's okay because when they run they they just keep running like this but and then still oh, fall okay, down okay it didn't yeah. work okay and he fall. died almost but oh. good luck a lot of people see saw and called called put the police okay and they came to help quickly did you catch him like in mean girls no oh, no no one can go down and help him except police or the the police the rescue workers the rescue workers rescued were what workers workers well that was a good story to try to get away from our question but let's get back to the question <laughs> should should soft drugs be legalized um i think no because some soft soft dr drugs not worst but not worst not soft drugs not we need another word soft drugs is not soft drugs because there's many of them soft drugs aren't words soft drugs bad. aren't and not worst no bad. aren't aren't bad we need another word aren't really no aren't aren't on what as ah uh, and as bad as hot yes okay but that's not the question but but someone but most people couldn't know how much couldn't know no can't know how much to use it like young people still dangerous for young people or someone okay but uh, we we got to fix the, the the sentence going on won't help us you're like the person who ran <laughs> off the cliff and you think <laughs> if you keep going farther it will be okay no no you <laughs> you got to fix the problem most young people most young people don't know don't understand don't understand how to use it how dangerous how dangerous you can't say how to use because that means that you know how to use it uh, and you like it how dangerous is it it is mm -hmm. good okay that makes sense uh that's an that, that would be an easier version of the answer uh i think it's it makes sense it's it, it's what uh, it's what i would expect someone to say it's not going to make anybody angry at you except for the part where you said that uh, you were the expert <laughs> people people are going to you I, might get arrested for that but uh, other than that that was good okay next one euthanasia well, euthanasia should be, should be legal very difficult word uh, uh, euthanasia means when doctors kill you mm to prevent you from having too much pain. So when it's an animal, we use a different word. We say putting it down. That's a putting idiom. It putting it down. So for example, like a long time ago, horses used to break their legs and no one could fix it and they would suffer, so they would usually shoot them in the head. Mm -hmm. So we would say put the dog down or put the horse down. but we don't use that word for people. Mm -hmm. You could, but it means that the that the people are animals. Mm -hmm. So if you said put him down, 
that means that he's, he's an animal, he's mm. garbage. The word we use for people is euthanasia. Euthanasia. It means, it means to kill someone, usually with Stop a... Stop hurting. Usually with some type of... Medicine. Uh, it's not medicine. Medicine helps you. Some type of drug that will kill you and then you don't feel any pain. And uh, some people think that that is, o is okay and some people say that that's not okay. So what do you think? I remember, uh, it's very funny, uh, there was a comedian. Uh, his, his name is Sasha Barrett Cohen. He has a very funny show. And in the show, he, at, he brought some experts, some doctors to talk about euthanasia. And he said, he said but... One but, of them said... No, no, but then he said, he said funny things to them. He's like, well, what if the youth in Asia don't want to die? Because... Huh? What do you use? Did because... You use? Listen, I'm going to explain. So, youth in Asia, just like when you made a mistake with a door, when you separate the word into three pieces, it's youth, that means kids, mm -hmm. in Asia. Asia, Asia. China. So he was joking that the word means kids in Asia. Oh. But the doctors in America, <laughs> of course, were expecting him to be talking about uh, euthanasia. So remember, when you put the words together, it has one meaning. Separation of the words yeah. is different. Adore together means love. A door is this thing behind me. Euthanasia means to put someone down mm -hmm. and the youth in Asia means kids in this area. Anyway, so uh, that was very funny. I, uh, I liked that uh, video. But we're not here to talk about that. We're here to talk about Sibti's opinion. What do you think, Sibti? If someone is suffering and they say, please, I don't want to live anymore. Should the doctor kill them? Should the doctor be able to kill them? What do you think? They are by themselves. Or other people decide Sometimes for they them. are sometimes they're unconscious. Sometimes and they're sleeping. They feel their family decided for them. Sometimes, but I don't think that's considered I don't think that's considered the same thing. So if someone needs life support, uh, I don't think that's considered the same thing, but I'm not sure. In our example, we're talking about someone who is alive and who, who says, I can't kill myself, but I want you to do it. What do you think? Is that acceptable or no? I think no. No. So someone, you see someone and they're, they're dying, but it's going to take a couple hours. And they say, please, Zipti, kill me. And you say, nah, uh, I'll just sit here and talk with you while but, you die. But probably they have chance to survive. Maybe, but probably not. What do you think, Zipti? It's really hard. Like, let's just talk for a few hours. They're like, please. But then, um, <laughs> please, Zipti. Mm -hmm. Like, no, no, I, I can't do it. I just want to talk. But we, but right now we had many things to help people don't hurt. But that's not the question. The question simply is, should it be legal? That's the question. Do you think it's okay or not? They hurt, they want to die. Yeah. They can can stay, can have life. But we can help them to sleep or do other thing. Other things. That's not the question. The question is should I it be legal? <laughs> <laughs> should it be legal for the doctor to be able to kill you? if you don't want to live anymore? I think no. Because? Because, because um, more, usually people didn't, don't want to survive when they hurt or feel bad, but 
they can't kill themselves, but they want other people to kill them. But sometimes, or uh, or if sometimes we have chain, other chain, chain, chains, like, oh, oh. to help that person, but we didn't need them to keep or turn. I don't know. Keep like be pretend. What do you say before you tell them? Like try to survive and and make the the doctors doctor doctors kill other people. It's not good because that will make doctors feel bad all their life because the doctor need to help needs doctor doctors need to help people to survive not killed not kill kill them mm. good mm -hmm. yeah good. <laughs> thank you so much makes sense uh, I think it's clear uh, it doesn't represent all of the situations uh, you're only taking into consideration uh, the the ones where people can be saved but that's okay uh, that's your argument and you can leave out uh, the difficult arguments on the other side there's nothing wrong with that this this is not a game to describe all parts of the argument it's just to make your argument for one side which is fine okay next one is the very famous saying that I have said on the show many times we have, an, we have a saying in English. We say, those who can do, do. And those who can't, they become teachers. So we have a saying in English. We say, uh, if you are very smart mm -hmm. and you know how to use your knowledge, then you do something with it. But if you're an idiot like me and you can't do anything, then you become a teacher. That is rule, rule. What do you think, Sipti? Those who do, do. And those who can't, they teach. What do you think? Is that true or not? I think, I think not true. Not true. I think not actually true. Not true. So you're saying that a person who is a math teacher in school, they want to make $10, $5 an hour, instead of working for NASA and making a hundred thousand dollars or a million dollars per minute you're saying that they want to be a teacher that's their choice they want to be poor and they want to be a teacher I didn't mean that oh no okay <laughs> then what, what is your argument <laughs> I mean if we if we don't have teachers or who want to be teachers not who or we don't have who no we need to describe people, who they are people who want to be a teachers a teachers no teachers mm. who will teach kids or students to be no s children to be good person, people, mm -hmm. people or teach them to have a good life. I think the teachers, the teachers, the, the teacher is the good work. I don't know. Teachers? Teacher are Teachers. Teachers are important for everyone. Okay, but that's not the question though. So you're talking about the importance of teachers, but I'm talking about the fact that some people are not good enough with their knowledge to use it for something else. So your argument is yeah, that teachers are important. Our our 
country is very different. Your country. Okay, but that that doesn't matter. We're only here to hear your opinions. Do you think that the people who become teachers are smarter than people at NASA or working on Wall Street? Do you think that the math professor who is in your school, who teaches you math, is smarter than the people at NASA doing the math or worse? Do they have to do that job or did they choose to do that job? That's the question. I don't know. Oh, we need an answer. What do you think? They are should. teachers teachers because they love teaching? Or are they teaching because they're not smart enough to work at NASA? But I don't know. Um but they should to be. They, they chose it. They should. Yeah. So NASA they sent them a letter. All the, all the, they can do all the work, but not NASA, but all the things. But they should to be teacher. They? They should to be a teacher. So NASA sent them a letter, the Wall Street banks doing calculations for AI trading. They, they sent them letters. And those teachers, they said, 10 million, 100 million, no. No, because I they want to teach kids. They know how much they can do for it. We need teacher to teach someone when they was young before they became, become to be, became to be. Become? Become to be. No to be. Become, become to. No to. Become, become B. No, become. Become A. Just the word. Become, become other. No, no, no words. Become, and then just tell something. us what they become. Become something. Teachers. Teacher. Become. What do you want to describe? Become. Other thing. I mean, people who work in NASA or doctor. Scientists. Scientists. Tss. Scientists. Tist. Scientists. Scientists. <laughs> Scientists. But there's another TS. Scientists. Scientists. Yeah. Okay, but you're talking about a different thing than me. So you're talking about teachers being valuable. And we all can accept that. That's true. But that's not the question. The question is, do you think that the people who become teachers are the smartest in that science? and they chose to be a teacher, or were they the, the lower quality one? The best ones went to NASA, the best ones went to the jobs that paid a lot, and these people were not good enough for those jobs, so they became teachers. Which one is true? Did they, did they choose to do it because they love it and they want to make no money, or were they not smart enough to do the real job? That's the it question. It can be both. It can be? <laughs> Let me can, tell you. Can it be, could be both, but it, the sentence cannot be that one. <laughs> it could be bo both. It could be both, okay. But what do you think? What's your opinion? But most people, I think, they don't have choice. So you're saying that teachers are not that smart. You're saying I'm an you're saying I'm an idiot. <laughs> I'm not. Oh no, okay. What are you saying? But I mean, they smart for the school to teach children. They smart for the school? No. For their work. They're good at teaching. They are good at teaching. They. They are good at. Teaching. So you think it's not about their talent, it's not about what they want to do, it's just because the people who become teachers are teachers because they're good at teaching, not because of how much money they can make or their talent. It's just because they're, it's not about the math, 
It's just about if they're a good teacher or not. The math is just separate from that. I don't know. This is hard. <laughs> That's why we're here, right? Well, Difficult other people answer. questions. Um, I don't remember anyone specifically answering this question, uh, but but I saw generally um, people will try to answer like you did, and try to if they support that side, they will try to say that teachers are valuable, and they'll try to stay away from the from the determination of intelligence, and then other people like me will just throw them under the bus. Because I can tell you, if I could work at NASA, I wouldn't be here. <laughs> I'm here because I have to be. But some, but people who work in NASA need many teachers to teach them. Yes, but that's not the question. So you keep going back to the the point of teachers being valuable, but that's not the question. The question is. But I saw in many movies. <laughs> okay, but I want the answer: yes or no. Do teachers have the ability to work at NASA and they chose to make no money being a teacher or were they not talented enough to work there? What do you think? I think I saw... <laughs> yes or no? I think they're not talented. They're not enough. talented enough. Enough. So Sipti is saying I'm an idiot. No, I mean That's true. I copy no, from okay. other movies. <laughs> Difficult question. Yes. Uh, I choose. I usually choose the funny ones when I'm answering questions. I don't. Uh, I, I. I. Personally, I like to be. Other I choose people the rude ones. said what? Most of. Like I told you, I, I can't remember specifically, but people people are are on both sides. People like me who are a little bit rude because can tend both. to choose the rude one, and then other people uh, who are more polite tend to say that some, it's their choice. Some people decide decided to be teacher more than to be scientist. Because I don't know what that means. I mean, some 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 teacher who's very smart. They don't want to be to work in NASA or other thing. They like to sp spend time to help other people to learn. Yes, uh, I understand. But you keep uh, going back to the the teachers being valuable, and w what we're just trying to answer is: Are they forced to do it because of their talent? That's all. And Sibti said that I'm an idiot. I'm not. No, no, okay, no. Anyway, uh, do you want to change your answer, or is that the answer? I, c I can. I can change. Hey, you can change it, but we only have one more minute. I think they chose by themselves. They chose. So NASA sent them a picture of the spaceship going to Mars. And they said, we're going to pay you $100 million per minute to build this. And they said, you know what? I like $10 per hour. And little kids screaming at me, pooping on their chairs. I prefer that. Because I, I can help 10 or 20 kids to be scientists. <laughs> Good. Exactly. Good answer. Uh, it's definitely the more polite answer. Uh, definitely the, uh, the, the answer that people will praise more. Uh, definitely the answer that people will respect more. Uh, I think that that was definitely a good choice. Anyway, that's the end of our show. Um, if you want to hear Sibti uh, being mean to your opinions hmm. on the next exciting ex episode of Controversial Questions, make sure to stay tuned. Question, Sibti? No. If you want to see Sibti eating a mushroom and running off the cliff, uh, <laughs> <I'm not. laughs> just add her on Be Instagram. Be careful, don't eat. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Beautiful mushroom. Right, don't eat beautiful mushrooms. Mushrooms. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye.